Hi, this is Mato. Today I will talk about crisis in life. Am I qualified? You bet I am. Who likes crisis? Nobody likes crisis. Let me tell you about one of my crises. Just one. I don't want to tell you all of them when I was 10 years old. I lived in Croatia with my grandmother. My parents were in different countries. My mother was in Australia and my father was in Germany. So I lived with my grandmother in a town called Drenovci. One of my friends got a chessboard and pieces for a present from his father who worked in Germany. And suddenly all kids in the street were playing chess. I joined. I was losing every game in four moves. Later on I learned that was form of checkmate. I didn't care much because I even didn't want to play. I just want to be with other kids. But one day one of the older kids said to me that I was stupid and that I should go home. And he said, you must be joking. He said, go home. You are not intelligent enough to be part of this group. I went home and cried a lot. And then I decided to improve my chess and to prove to these kids in the street that I am intelligent just like them. But can you imagine that other kids kick you out of the group because you are not intelligent enough? That would hurt. Huh? So. I was waiting for my grandmother to come home and to ask her to buy me a chessboard. When she came home, I asked, and she said that I'm stupid because if she had money, she said she would buy me shoes. I said, I don't need shoes. I need a chessboard. It was summertime. She said, no. But then I used this magic formula which kids use. I said, I will do anything if you buy me a chessboard. And she said, I'll buy you a chessboard if you become an A grade student. I was a B grade student then. I said, okay. I studied hard and at the end of the year, I became an A grade student and I had a certificate to prove it. My grandmother was proud of me and she was showing my certificate to all people that are passing through the street. And then it was her time to fulfill her obligation. We went from my hometown, Drenovci, in Croatia, to Bosnia, Brčko. We were walking there. We didn't have money to pay for the bus ticket. So we walked to Bosnia. And then when we arrived in, in Bosnia, in that city, I saw a chessboard display there and we went inside. And I say my, to my grandmother, this is the chessboard that I want. My grandmother took her handkerchief out with hundreds and hundreds of coins, like five cents coins. And the lady shop assistant, she counted all the money and she said, you don't have enough money for the big chessboard. So I said, it's okay, we'll buy a medium one. And then there was not enough money for the medium board. So we bought a small one. But then I borrowed a book, worked on my chess, and when I was grade 7, I could beat anyone in chess in my hometown, even the best player, a teacher of history. So, that crisis was very relevant for what I am doing now. If kids were not nasty to me, I would probably never enjoy my chess career now. If life gives you a lemon, make a lemonade. If you have crisis in your life right now, you should know that this may be a golden opportunity to achieve great success in your life. And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck in converting your crisis into a success. Bye for now.